Frederick Wiseman is America's greatest living documentary maker who's just made his first film in Britain. So just why has he chosen our very own National Gallery in Trafalgar Square as the subject? Here's our arts correspondent, Brenda Manis. So this is the story of Moses. It's a story about how a little baby boy is sent down the river. Young minds are introduced to old masters, a workshop at that great British institution, the National Gallery, now the subject of the latest project by renowned American documentary maker, Frederick Wiseman. You might like to see more stories about Moses, and there are lots of other stories about Moses in the National Gallery. The 85-year-old filmmaker spent 12 weeks at the Trafalgar Square site to produce this three-hour documentary, putting all operations of the gallery in the frame. You were given a, a tremendous access. You were here, what, for 12 weeks? Right. And did you come with a perception of the gallery? Or no, no. I mean, I'd been here as a visitor on many occasions, but I really didn't know anything about it. And I, I was pleased that Nick Penny and his staff had confidence in me. And, and the only thing I couldn't shoot here were discussions of personnel which is quite reasonable. Turn of Rembrandt, Caravaggio. Michelangelo's Poussin. Vermeer's Leonardo da Vinci. Now you shot at a time when the, the gallery was showcasing the likes of Titian and Turner and it was the end of the Leonardo blockbuster. Was that a coup or was that, was that wonderfully timed? I deliberately picked the period in which the film was going to be shot so, so that I'd have an opportunity to uh, get the Leonardo exposition and the Turner. It's about life. Anything you are interested in goes into art. I knew I wanted the tours, and I knew I wanted a lot of paintings, and I wanted meetings, and I wanted the various departments. So basically, uh, what we did during the shooting is collect material without my having any idea about how I was going to use it. In providing an engaging insight for viewers, Frederick has also benefited from his laborious achievement. One of the nice things about doing these movies is that it's like a, a course in adult education where I'm the alleged adult and every year I get a new subject to study. There's no big dramatic tension in this epic film, but lots of VIP access to great art. Brenda Imanis, BBC London News.